So, you've came here to know how to defeat your enemy. You clicked on this video to acquire the true ways of defeating and destroying your enemy. Well, you came to the right place. I will show you the ropes and the true ways of defeating and completely annihilating your enemies. So stick close to find out the true way. To become very powerful, you must first defeat your enemy. And by doing that, you become even more powerful. It's like one plus one. So, let me give you an example. Let's say you're on a server, in a normal server, and these sweaty people start aiming for you, try harding on you, and doing all that classic stuff. Well, you got to use their speech against themselves and find disadvantages and ways to um, completely annihilate them. Now, I'm gonna go more in depth in that. So basically much, you gotta know the disadvantages and advantages in speech wise, gameplay wise, and other type of things. Now, I learned from my mistake and I will not say disadvantages and advantages every single time because uh yeah the last video was a uh, yeah we, uh, we didn't talk about that anyway so like I said before you must know the disadvantages advantages why they're doing it and um find the key ways to probably maybe use their words around them or against them but now you're probably thinking yeah but I already did that let me cut it down to a better example so let's say you wound up with an argument with your friend or family member and the argument is still going to be pointless because you're just going to be in a circle of death and basically much you want your opinion to be higher than the other person's opinion but the other person's opinion is also trying to become higher than your opinion and it's just going to be like a stack of dominoes until it all falls down and an argument is usually tied to anger and usually people like to use anger and stuff to completely destroy their enemies now what I want you to do right now is to completely dump everything I just said to you about how to destroy an enemy and how to completely defeat them and annihilate them and all that stuff throw it out the window because all that has already happened you've been trying for so long to do that method and not only are you doing it your enemy is also doing that to you too and you soon realize that it's not going to get you anywhere so the best way the complete best way the ultimate way to defeat your enemy is to love your enemy, respect them, show kindness towards them, show peace and gratitude towards them. When your enemy asks for a glass of water, you give them a glass of water. If your enemy asks for food, you give them food. Never try and go for the destruction route. Always start with the creation route. And you see how far you can get make the best out of what you have. The best way to defeat your enemy is to make them your friend. If you become friends with your enemy, then you can have literally no enemies. What Jesus meant was love your enemy. And I also believe that meant have no enemy. Think about it. If you have no enemies, who's going to be your enemy? And I want you to really think about that. You could literally use this weapon to completely annihilate people. And I don't mean by annihilating them, I mean by annihilating them with kindness, love, and gratitude. Literally, anyone who will try to step towards you will completely get annihilated and will just fall like all of them, and they'll fall by being your friend. 
Now, not everyone will try to become your friend because, you know, you don't always want to be a people pleaser. But it's always worth trying. And even if they don't want to become your friend, you can still respect them. And maybe you, maybe you would even like try to become friends. Maybe sooner or later they will try to become friends with you. And then the cycle will repeat. So that is how to defeat an enemy. Don't try to show destruction, show kindness. And I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Dealing with these type of people is annoying. I get it. They want to um, throw fists at you, but you want to show kindness to them. And basically, you just got to exercise self control in not getting provoked too much. And yeah, then you're good. So, that is how to defeat an enemy. Um. Huh. <laughs> I made it pretty. Try to make it pretty simple to understand. But other than that, it is pretty good. And don't forget to always love and hope that people are still trying to destroy you or trying to like make enemies with you. Hope that they will change one day and see the truth and the light. I don't know why I said truth like that. And hope that they have a nice day. And hope that you have a nice day too. See ya.